Hi guys and welcome back to our YouTube channel. We are in Nueva Andalucía in Las Prisas and we have a really cool home full of surprises to show you. So let's go. <laughs> Smash that like button if you enjoyed today's intro. Big thanks to Swish, the luxury rental company behind this property and today's tour. They rent this beauty to 10 people if you want because you have five bedrooms in this property, 650 square meters of built area and 1,111 square meters of plot. Now guys, that's enough of all the details about the property. I love it because I'm a huge fan of layouts, right? This entire floor has such a really comfortable layout from where you can see everything happening. You can see your kids play in the snuck TV area that we're going to discuss later or observe how they do silly stuff maybe on this biggest coffee table I've ever seen. Patrick, have you seen a bigger one than this? No. This is bigger than your bed. I don't think we can call it a coffee table. It's <laughs> yeah. a table. It's a, a very ping pong. Table. It's a double ping pong table. You also get to see, by the way, the play of colors. There's a lot of white in contrast to black, and that's nice. I like black and white, especially when they are put together. We have a television setup, fireplace, open shelving with the black wood, as explained before, carpet laid out on the hardwood flooring that we have in this entire level as well, a humongous front of windows that you can slide open, but also bring the luminosity and the views outwards, which is great. Now let's have a look at the kitchen. But before we do, ladies and gentlemen, we have a snack TV area right over here. Big fan of the industrial looking window right there. We also have a office which is located here. And that's what I mean. Everything is in its own vicinity, which is fantastic. Come here, do a little bit of work before you jump into the pool or play some golf because we have Las Brisas Golf right up front. Another outdoor chill out area which also has an access point to the garage. And yeah, ladies, <laughs> ladies, just ladies. It's actually, I think 80% are men. So hey, ladies, more of you, please. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we have the dining table right in front which actually sits 12 people, which is crazy and this designer kitchen, vaulted ceiling, exposed wooden beams. This entire interior design of the house is very Scandinavian Czech. It's very bright and I like that because you live in a place where the sun shines a lot. You want brightness in your life. Now, monochrome, color, countertop, all in black, natural stone, Gaggenau appliances, Absolutely no extractor dangling down because we have it nicely installed here. Drawers and cupboards throughout the entire property as well here in the kitchen. We have a further sink here picture window looking out to the greenery, fridge and freezer on both ends. As I said, Gagan appliances are to be found here. So when you are cooking in your home in the Mediterranean, you can actually make very good food in qualitative appliances. Also have this Gaginar coffee machine, which always works great. All right, let's continue. The subdivision is great. Kitchen, living room, snug, chill out area, office, outdoor, chill out area. I mean, you find everything in such a nice enclosed space. Now we also have two further bedrooms on this floor. One to the right, one to the left. Let's have a look at the right one. And now to the nicer bedroom, this one, come on. Now you know what I mean with a nicer bedroom. This one's much bigger. I would even say it could be the master bedroom on this floor. We have wallpapers throughout, 
nice wooden bed framing, everything is continuous when it comes to style and design, ensuite bathroom as you've seen in the detail shots and of course this big front that also slides open giving you access to your own terrace staircase that leads down to the swimming pool so the views you're seeing it as well in the detail shots the views are fantastic wake up open it run down to the pool swim a few laps go to the kitchen make yourself a coffee from the Gaggenau coffee machine what a perfect way to start the day and yeah the coloring of the wallpaper is also really smooth Nothing in this house is in your face. Everything blends and the decor is very seamlessly. And mellow. I and mellow, say. yeah. Just now let's go upstairs. Wait, 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 wait. You forgot something. What cannot be My missing hair? when you have so many guests here? A guest. Uh, strippers? <laughs> guest strippers? What? what? Guest? What, what can be missing when you have so many guest guests? Toilet. Strippers, a DJ. Guest toilet. Oh, cupboard spaces. And yeah, the guest toilet. I actually factory really love this grayish looking natural stone on the one sink vanity that we have here. It's solid and it's got a lot of nice natural play of structures inside. Solid. Solid brav. And the toilet. All right, scooch out. Come on, chup chup. Let's go. Off we are. What, where are we going, Upstairs. Dominic? By the way, you have these slots as well of picture windows, more light coming in and this staircase with the continuation of the hardwood floor leading up to the first floor where the entire floor is reserved for the main bedroom. More picture windows, natural light coming in. Also very nice detailing with recessed lighting, indirect lighting in this house as well. You're probably seeing that in the night shots. If you are, thumbs up guys. Smash that like button, let us know. What do you think? Yeah, hi, right, let's go upstairs. Spacious, continuous in style and design. Little kickback chair here to come and sit down and just observe the beauty of chair that Chair or sofa? Did I say chair? I would say chair. Did not. What? So what now? I said chair, you said sofa. I said sofa. You said and I chair. said chair? You sure? Yes. I'm not sure, Patrick. Anyways, chair, sofa. It's a perfect spot to come and relax just after you wake up if you're too tired to continue going anywhere. <laughs> Anyways, we also have a walk-in closet right over here. Nicely illuminated, indirect lighting as well. This entire section to put your socks and watches, cupboard spaces, everything you need is here. And a window for natural light. Ensuite bathroom, ladies and gentlemen, let's have a look. Two sink vanity setup, granite taps and fittings. We also have a bathtub. As you know, I always like to say it's important to at least bath once a month to detoxify yourself. Look at that really big picture window, Patrick, and the luminosity it brings in. Is the camera getting that? Yes, it is. Fantastic. We also have this, and I have seen uh, these light fixtures once before. They're super interesting, and yeah. And look who you Different can see. Different kind of scones. This is interesting. Hello. <laughs> we also have drawer set up right underneath. The house comes with all the appliances you need, hair dryers and etc. Toilet paper is always going to be there. We have a toilet right there, talking about toilet paper, a shower, and everything's nicely closed. And you get to see, once again, the black detailing in the frame, and then the entire house is continuous. Now, yeah, Patrick? I just want to clarify something, because it was in the comment section last time. People, this here, the little fluff thing is the mic. So when I look into the screen, it's the same distance when I look at you. Wow. Yes. Dude, that's some clever People stuff. People were like giving all sorts of comments what hey it guys, could be. I just want to clarify those are my shades. This is a shirt. Let's continue. <laughs> there. <laughs> Come on. Guys, you've seen how rude Patrick is showing me the fingers. Now the basement's full of surprises and to be quite frank, when I first saw this home, I was like, right, it's a super nice house, but there's something missing until I went downstairs. Let's go. Now, it's a entertainment area like this one. Ladies and gentlemen, like the old habits, whenever there's a pool table, I'm gonna smash the ball, and if I get any in, you, you guys- know what? How about this? I smash it. Come here, grab the camera. Oh, wow, are we flexing like this? Right, guys, so if Patrick gets a ball in, you have to subscribe to our channel. Let's do this. I mean, just before Patrick does all the setup, Look at all the detailing here, the furniture. Don't move the camera too much. The interior design is continuous. 
Now Patrick's giving me commandos on what to do or not. Are you ready? I am ready. And... <laughs> See? Oh! No, Patrick didn't get one ball in. That's not true. Everyone's unsubscribing Look, now. the two's in. Solid. What a liar. All right, Patrick, I, I, would, I have to say, I would really like to have something like this at home. What do you guys think about Patrick's failure shot? Let's see, let's see, like, look, look, a little. There, another one in. You nice. See? I never really liked Paul, to be honest. But you just said you wanted to have one, and you got the white one in, that gives me two yeah, shots. If I would have one, I would practice and become better in doing so, but... Yeah, I'm not such a big, you know, hanging around bars type of guy. All right, let's move on from that, ladies and gentlemen. We have a chill out lounge here, TV setup, and two further bedrooms completing the five bedrooms I mentioned before. Let's have a look at this one. Love it that it has a natural light source as well. This is a little dirty kitchen, so maybe this bedroom could be used by your nanny, your cleaning staff, or whomever likes to have a dirty kitchen right next to his bedroom. And now, second bedroom on this level. Let's have a look. Right there. Now here I just want to point out the natural light source as well coming in, which is fantastic. You are in the basement, but you really don't feel like it. You've seen of the ensuite toilet in the detail shots and a walk-in closet as well here. So this is just as good as the other bedrooms we have seen on the other levels, which is great, no compromises. Let's continue. To my favorite place of the house, ladies and gentlemen, and it's uh, this spa area, which I didn't know existed and really brought the level of this property up in my opinion. So let's look. Oh, and it's actually really nice and warm and it smells like swimming pool, which is cool. Now we have a wooden decked area, swimming pool, the natural stone with the backdrop lighting is also fantastic. I'm it's sure onyx, it, isn't it? Onyx it stone? It could be, but I'm not 100% sure, so I don't want to say something which isn't correct. But at night, you'll see how nicely it's illuminated, so all the veins in the natural stone pop out. And yes, yeah, swimming pool number two in this house. It's also nicely, oh, it's nicely heated. But hey, that's not it, because we have lounge chairs here. Behind this here, which you wouldn't even think there is anything, you just pop it open and we have an entire continuation of things. Let's look. Shower, toilet, sauna, Turkish bath. Perfect combination. Patrick likes the sauna. I'm more of a Turkish bath kind of guy because so I like humidity. So when we would rent this place, we would never find it. We over, would, we would never. Where to go. No, I'll be here, you'd be there. Maybe through the wall we can communicate. Hey dude, what's up? How are you doing? Morse with like bang. Yeah, turn around because we also have a two sink vanity, more open shelving here. And of course, uh, my well, dear look brother. Look at this, another barrel. Hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah guys, if we just show this little detail as well, there's the LED lighting inside of uh, the door here, which goes on once we close it. So I'm gonna have to close it, Patrick. Okay. You ready? Man. What are you doing? Close oh. it. I'm sure at night this home looks epic. We're gonna discover it and also include it into the entire tour. Now guys, let's continue. A little fitness room right at the end of this corridor. Use the bicycle, run out, jump into the pool. Couldn't imagine a better workout sequence. Or, <laughs> or come here and grab one of the numerous wines in your wine cooler and just enjoy your afternoon in this way rather than in the fitness way. Dominic, do you like wine? Do I like wine? I do like wine, but only when it's a good wine. And what I mean with that, when it's smooth, like a Ribera del Duero, it's nice and smooth. But if it's like a Rioja, it's too dry and I don't like it. It's like oh answer God, your I, question. I didn't know you are such a connoisseur of uh, wines. I'm not really, but I just know if it's a Ribera del Duero and it's, it's at least like four years old, it's good. See, to I'm my much liking. more simpler than you. I like beer. No, I like to, alcohol is there to get hammered. Let's go. <laughs> I like, <laughs> should cut that out. We're not promoting alcohol. He means hammered as in physical workout. All right, guys, let's look at the outdoor area, the outdoor terrace and the swimming pool and basically the garden. So let's go. 
A beautiful outdoor dining area, dine al fresco, that's what you do here in Marbella, it's part of the lifestyle. You also have a further chill out lounge and a staircase that leads down to the lower landing with a swimming pool, big areas to come and lounge, sunken pit right there, barbecue area with another dining possibility and this automated decking as well which opens and gives you more light. And yeah, just a great space to come and enjoy the winter, which is mostly sunny here in Marbella, ladies and gentlemen. As you can see, it's nearly October and we still have 25, 26 degrees. Now, this is one of my favorite places of the house where you can come with your friends, have a couple of drinks, make a fire, talk, laugh, and just simply enjoy the panoramic view of greenery that you have here you have Las Brisas Golf right in front as well. Superb, so if you're a golf fan, this home is pretty neat and it's definitely not just for golfers, so <laughs> don't get me wrong. And yeah, guys, this is basically it of the tour. Thank you so much for tuning in. We do wish you a lovely day. Stay tuned because we're gonna to be touring many more properties, especially from Swish, because they have some of the greatest listings and now you can see the winds picking up ladies and gentlemen so Patrick and I are going to go down to the beach and kite surf because you can do that here in Marbella too. Over and out.